Hi, everyone. I'm Gabriel Nung, and I'm a PhD student in the Propel Lab at Holland Bloorview, and here to talk a little bit about gate analysis algorithms using wearable sensors to inform monitoring and decision making in amputee rehabilitation. Now, amputation and lower limb disability can significantly change how you walk. Uh, you're compensating for loss of muscles and for different prosthetic components, and this can be very challenging for anyone learning how to do this. So efficient training is really important for uh, ensuring that our clients can meet their mobility goals and enabling the best and healthiest outcomes over time. Conventional physio, which I've depicted below, is a back and forth process where clients are meeting with a physio and the physio is prescribing different exercises and monitoring how they're doing during these to assess how they're progressing and tailoring their treatment over time. Now, while this is effective, it's placing a significant burden on the PTs to continuously, from the outside, try to assess how they think that their, part, their client is doing and make decisions about the rehab. And it's missing a huge potential to optimize the way that PTs can evaluate clients and make decisions through the rehab process. Now, one manner to assist PTs is through gait analysis technology and researching and adopting that in standard clinical practice. Now, there are a variety of different kinds of systems that can do this. Uh, our, we are primarily focused on inertial sensors. These sensors are low cost, they're simple to set up and use, and they can still provide lots of useful information. Uh, I'm betting this is most of you, but for anyone who has a smartphone or a smartwatch like an Apple Watch, all of these have inertial sensors, which are dictating a lot of the information you're getting from them. And as you can see, they're very unobtrusive, very easy to use. And that's really important for developing systems that clients and PTs want to can incorporate in their day-to-day -day habits and rehabilitation. So that's really the focus of my research, which is looking at wearable sensor data collected during physiotherapy sessions and using that to develop systems that can expand rehab in and out of the clinic. These systems could be used in the clinic for progress evaluation, providing insights to PTs about specific gait features as well as their overall gait so that they can make objective and informed decisions about how their client is progressing in the exercises that are working for them. And we could also extend the system to be used outside for real-time feedback and monitoring uh, in the outside the clinic. This can allow us and clients to take their training and tips with them wherever they go, at home, work, or wherever they are, and uh, monitor their gait and provide feedback to make sure that they're making consistent progress and making the fastest uh, progress possible. And so by understanding these relationships between gait analysis and conventional rehab, this can allow us to develop uh, intuitive systems that clinicians can easily use to evaluate gait and improve outcomes. Now, if you're interested in this type of research, feel free to check out my poster, and I look forward to seeing some of you shortly.